Another great thing to do for the holidays is you can come down to the Irvine Spectrum and you know what, you can shop and you can also skate. They have an outdoor figure skating rink where you can go, you're gonna eat, then you're gonna go work off the calories and behind me are US figure skaters. This is Rockney Brubaker and Mary Beth Marley and we wanna talk to you from What's Up Orange County. Come on in, how are you guys doing? Doing really well. So um, you are gonna be competing at the national championships when is that it is uh, at the end of January coming up so we're very excited for it how long have you guys been skating together um, we've been skating about um, 14 months together yeah now I heard about you she said she would not do pairs unless it was with who with Rockney Brubaker I did say that <laughs> Oh, she did say that so I know you guys have been starting the season off we got a little bit of the Grand Prix but you have a couple months to make this happen right yeah we do it's still early in the season so after our international competitions now we have some time to come back and fine-tune and get ready for the national championships right, so we have a lot of viewers that love figure skating and they wanted me to ask you Marley you have said that when you tried out with Rockney that it was a defining life moment so uh why is that? It opened up my skating to a whole new level and it really showed me what I really wanted to do in the sport. So you were doing uh, singles and pairs but you you know that you got some championship going here so you went for pairs only now? Yeah I just I wanted to fully commit to one so that it could really be something special and you know I don't really want to be the one getting fourths and fifths and like just being good enough I really want to be great. Right, we're looking gold medal at the U.S. Championships and we're looking to maybe that go on to the World Championships next. Now, Rockney, for you, we heard that you're an avid music lover and that you can actually play an instrument too. I can, I can play a few instruments, uh, piano and guitar. Music's kind of always been my second passion, so uh, skating uh, keeps me pretty busy. I don't get to play as much as I'd like, but it's a nice hobby to have. Right, so the skating to make it to the top level is not that easy. How many hours a day do you have to practice? Um, we usually practice around two and a half to three hours on the ice and a lot of hours off the ice just doing workouts and, you know, just everything else on top. You're working it, right? Yeah, it's definitely is exercise, right? Oh, yeah, it's, it's a full-time gig. Everything from, like she said, the on ice to off ice to, you know, PT, physical therapy, recovery. It's, uh, we stay busy with it, that's for sure. Yeah. So it makes you probably feel the music more, right? Oh yeah, absolutely. Musicality is a big part of what we do, so understanding that helps to translate to the ice. Right. So what music are you going to be skating to at the championships? Um, for our short program, we're skating to a medley of Sing in the Rain, and our long is Selections from Rachmaninoff. So yeah, we saw we saw you on TV last year on the national championships, and I we go. They've only been together for how long? Because I thought you guys could almost win it all. So it was we're only about five months at that time. So it wasn't long at all when you talk about pair skating in general. So yes. and uh, you think maybe your coaches have anything to do with it? I heard you guys have some great coaches, right? Yeah, Jenny Mino and Todd Sand. Uh, they were pretty good skaters in their day. So we're uh, we're in pretty good hands. They know what it's like to get some medals, right? Yeah, that's for sure. Right. Isn't this great down at the Irvine Spectrum? You can literally shop, you can eat, and then you can skate, right? Oh, it's awesome. It's a full day for uh, you know family and friends, and uh, hopefully we can get some people out here to come and enjoy the ice. Yes, well, we're so glad you came down. We know you got to get back to practicing, but will you show us a couple moves? That'd be awesome. Absolutely. You know, we want to see. What are you going to do for us? A spin? We're going to do a death spiral and a pair spin. We're going for the death spiral and a pair spin. Here it is, Rockney Brubaker and Mary Beth Marley, future champions. We're excited. Check it out. Here we go. I tell you, they're unbelievable. They're gonna win it. <laughs>